All right, what is 6.33 p.m. on Tuesday, April 20th, 2021. Um, good evening, my name is Christian Klein. I'm the chair of the Arlington Zoning Board of Appeals. I call this meeting of the board to order. I'd like to confirm. <laughs> Make sure all members and anticipated officials are present. Um, so from the Zoning Board of Appeals, Roger DuPont. Here. Mr. Hanlon. Here. Mills. Here. Mr. O'Rourke. Here. Mr. Ford. Here. Mr. Ravelak. Here. Greetings to all. Uh, for the town, uh, Rick Valorelli. Here. And Vincent Lee. Here. I want to thank you both. Um, outside Council, uh, Paul Haverty. Good evening, Mr. Chairman. Good evening. And on behalf of the applicant, uh, Ms. Kiefer. Good evening. Good evening, all. So this open meeting of the Arlington Zoning Board of Appeals is being conducted remotely consistent with Governor Baker's executive order of March 12, 2020. The order suspends the requirement of the open meeting law to have all meetings in a publicly accessible physical location. Further, all members of public bodies are allowed and encouraged to participate remotely. Public bodies may meet remotely so long as reasonable public access is afforded so the public can follow along with the deliberations of the meeting. An opportunity for public participation we provided during public comment period during the public hearing. For this meeting, the Arlington Zoning Board of Appeals has convened a video conference via the Zoom app with online and telephone access as listed on the agenda posted to the town's website identifying how the public may join. This meeting is being recorded and is being broadcast by ACMI. Please be aware attendees are participating by a variety of means. Some attendees are participating by video conference. Other participants are participating by computer audio or phone. Accordingly, please be aware that other folks may be able to see you, your screen name, or another identifier. Please take care to not share personal information. Anything you broadcast may be captured by the recording. We ask you to please maintain decorum during the meeting, including displaying an appropriate background. All supporting materials that have been provided members of this body are available on the town's website unless otherwise noted. Public is encouraged to follow along using the posted agenda. Mr. Chair, I reserve the right to take items out of order in the interest of promoting an orderly meeting. So turning to the uh, comprehensive permit hearing for Thorn Dyke Place. Um, so at the April 8th hearing, the Zoning Board of Appeals requested the applicant consider reintroducing duplex or townhouse units along Dorothy Road with a multifamily unit behind. Keeping the project within the bounds of the upland portion of the site outside the statutory wetlands and floodway. The applicant has indicated to the board that they believe they can meet these goals and they've requested additional time to prepare design drawings for public review. Um, and so the, the request which we will uh, we'll get to at the end would be to continue this hearing um, to Thursday, May 13th at 7.30 p.m. And we will request that the submission or revised the design documents on or before May 10th, 2021 to allow for review ahead of next, the next meeting date. Um, and uh, Ms. Kiefer, does that meet with your expectations? It does, Mr. Chairman, yes, thank you. Thank you. So the statutory 180 day period for conducting a public hearing um, is currently scheduled to expire this Friday, April 23rd. So we will need to extend it to a later date to allow for the review of the revised design and consideration of the design of the proposed conditions. Um, the date that we are, that was proposed to extend to would be Thursday, May 20th, excuse me, 2021. Um, and Ms. Kiefer, that's per our discussion this morning. Yes. Perfect. So, oops. So, with those in mind, um, would, Mr. Hanlon, can I have a motion to extend the statutory 180 day period for conducting a public hearing? Mr. Chairman, I move that the board extend the uh, time for completing the public hearing until a date certain of. May 20th, uh, as agreed upon with the applicant. Thank you. I have a second from the board. Second. second. Thank you, Mr. DuPont. Uh, 
Uh, so to take a vote of the board, uh, Mr. DuPont. Aye. Mr. Hanlon. Aye. Mr. Mills. Aye. Mr. O'Rourke. Aye. Mr. Revelak. Aye. Mr. Ford. Aye. The chair votes aye. So the 180 day review period is hereby extended to Thursday, May 20th, 2021. Um, and that will bring us back to the request to continue. So again, the, it will be a continuance to Thursday, May, 30, May 13th at 7.30 p.m. And this uh, revised documentation will be submitted on or before May 10th, 2021 to allow for review. Um, Mr. Hanlon, may I have a motion to that effect? Mr. Chairman, I move that the uh, hearing be continued to a date certain of May 13th, uh, 2021 at 7.30 p.m. Uh, and that the applicant provide copies of revised materials uh, on or before May 10th, uh, 2021. Thank you. May I have a second? Second. Thank you, Mr. Mills. So a vote of the board. Um, Mr. DuPont? Aye. Mr. Hanlon? Aye. Mr. Mills? Aye. Mr. O'Rourke? <clears throat> Mr. Revelak? Aye. Mr. Ford? Aye. And the chair also votes aye. So the hearing on Thorndike Place is hereby continued to May 13th at 7.30 p.m. Um, so that is all sort of the substantive work for this evening, uh, just for the boards and the public's edification. So um, upcoming meetings of the Zoning Board of Appeals. So we currently have scheduled a meeting for Tuesday, April 27th, which will be a continuance of 190, 192 Mystic Valley Parkway and a continuance of comprehensive permit hearing for 1165R Massachusetts Avenue. Um, and I've also asked the um, uh, Mr. Valarelli to add on the election of board officers, uh, which is something we need to do annually in April. Um, so we'll add that to the uh, to that hearing as well. Um, then the next hearing after that is May 11th, uh, which will be the first hearing for uh, three new projects, uh, 12 Christine Road, 34 Marathon Street, and 53 Pine Ridge Road. Um, now we also have on May 13th will be the continuance of the hearing on Thorndike Place. And Mr. Valerelli has notified me that um, Tuesday, May 25th, we will have um, at least one, if not a few other uh, new local cases. Um, and so those are all the dates on our calendar. Uh, any questions on those dates of the board? No, perfect. Okay, well, that concludes tonight's meeting of the Arlington Zoning Board of Appeals. Uh, Mr. Chairman? Yes, please. A quick question, Steve Moore, Piedmont Street. Uh, are the Tuesday meetings always at 6.30? No, so we've been, we had done 6.30 for a while. Um, the next several hearings will be back at 7.30. Okay, thank you. Thank you, I appreciate the request for clarification. Okay, so, um, Appreciate everyone's patience throughout the meeting. I wish to thank uh, Mr. Valarelli and Mr. Lee for their assistance in preparing for and hosting this online meeting. Please note the purpose of the board's recording of the meeting is to ensure the creation of an accurate record of the proceedings. And it's our understanding the recording made by ACMI will be available on demand at acmi.tv within the coming days. If anyone has questions, comments, or recommendations, please send them via email to zba at town.arlington.ma.us. That email address is also listed on the Zoning Board of Appeals website. Um, to conclude tonight's meeting, I look for a motion to adjourn. So moved. Mr. Hanlon. Second. Thank you, Mr. Mills. Mr. DuPont. Aye. Mr. Hanlon. Aye. Mr. Mills. Aye. Mr. O'Rourke. Aye. Mr. Revelak. Aye. Mr. Ford. Aye. And the chair votes aye. We are adjourned. Thank you all for your participation tonight. I, um, especially whereas we are going by so quickly um, and we will see everyone at an upcoming meeting. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you all. Good night, everyone. Thank you, Sean. Thank, Thank you. Everyone. you.